I'm going to do time lapse photography. Okay, so note the time on the videotape. Yeah, it's 546. When all that snow melts off the grill, it's time to throw the tri-tip on. Okay, see, most of the snow is off. See how I have it cracked open just a little bit so I can see if it catches on fire. Winter Grilling 101. I'm going to YouTube it. If I could sell it, I would, but I'm sure people just will want to watch it for free. I'm going to name it Grilling and Clogs 101. Why do we always name 101? Actually, this is probably senior level shit. I'll show you. POV style. Look at that. For tacos. Huh? Try tip for tacos. Mm. POV. Oops. I'll edit that. Let's be recording. See what happens when you're unattentive? That's why this is Grilling and Clogs 301. It's a senior level grilling class. But if you're smart, you'll leave a little like thing stuck in the grill so you can see when it catches on fire and then you can identify the meat as long as you have a high definition video camera. Whoops. With uh, stabilization and autofocus. Another recently discovered secret is grilling in the winter in clogs is most flare-up problems can be easily solved with a snowball. And they're readily available because see to the right and to the left you have snowballs. And you see the center grill? Crack? No! Flare-ups. Gotta love it.